Put up all the way to the top, so I have to do the same. So I'm now taking off. here is I'm checking to make sure that both sides are equal in length so they match up as a pair. I just got to adjust one and it's the one that I'm making that I adjust so those two match up as a pair I finished the curtains time to tidy up here we have now two curtains being joined together here we can see the, the other one underneath tape is put on on a 
I've got to do now is tidy up, get rid of all the cotton. Opening it up to show you the seam. join the curtains together it's finished all I've got to do now is do the other side and we've got a pair of curtains so what I did today's lesson I had four curtains um, and joined two together to make a pair and I showed you how I did it I cut one side off um, and the other side make sure that it's mirror image put the two together took down the hem turn it up because the customer wanted it six inches and because I interfered with the center seam I now had to put a new tape on it you don't have to put a new tape on it but I recommend you do it's a better finish as you can see that's the joining of the new tape. That's the center seam of it. And we've now got one straight run. run. And now if you take the choice to stitch up the middle of it, stitch it up and join it together, you've now got to tie these strings back together. But remember this, when you pull the strings, you will always have this kind of a bump and it's not equal to the rest. That is why you don't do it. But if you want to keep your cost down then go ahead thank you for watching my show you take this there's a trick to everything the better tape gives a better quality of how this pencil pleat stands up you can see these are nice and sharp right the closer they are to better the closer they are together the better they look as you can see this is very uniformed it's sharp it stands up it looks the business that is beautiful. Now, in order to do this as well, you must pull all three strings, but you make sure that they're all equal to each other. So you go along and you adjust all these strings and make sure they're sharp, giving you a sharper look at the top. And there is also a trick to how you hang them up. You also have to make sure you equally space them out. 
because even though this is not pinch pleat, you can also get the curtain pencil pleat at the bottom of it to look like pinch pleat effects. That's another story. Pencil pleat curtains altered to look a different quality.